Howdy ho, howdy ho, generic long hair guy. <laughs> oh, how y'all doing out there today? I want to say something straight right off the rip today. And what that is, is that I, in no way, shape, or form, am Ray Ray from Ray Ray's Lawn Care. I don't know what the confusion is. I'm my own man. I'm I'm generic lawn care guy, you know? And uh, to be honest, let I me mean, look at me. I'm way, way prettier than Ray Ray. You know, so that should be a clue to you right there. But old Ray Ray, he ought to be, he ought to be flattered. You know, that he's being compared to me. Uh, that ought to be a lot of flattering going on his way. But anyways, I don't want to be known as just another pretty face on the YouTubeage, you know. I want to be known as well for my great and powerful intellect. That's right. I got a lot of brains going on up in here, all up in here, full of it. And uh, I want to share some of my vast knowledge with you guys. And I was philosophizing the other day about this uh, these gas prices. What do you think about that, man? It's getting outrageous with that that guy in office, man. He he done messed things up. I tell you that right now. He sure did. And uh, but I think when when my when my powerful gray matter that I've come up with a solution because I've been trying this for a couple of weeks now, and I'm gonna share. It with you out of the kindness of my big heart that I have I'm gonna share it with you um, what I came up with is I got to thinking you know we were out here mowing these yards with that mowing it's already heavy the mower's already heavy as could be if you would drop one of them on your crock <laughs> I tell you break your toe but uh I tell you what they're already heavy, so I came up with this idea. Not everybody could do this, okay? So don't feel bad if you never came up with it because you ain't got you ain't got what it takes up here like a uh, generic lawn care guy do. But what you do is uh, it's already heavy and you gotta think you're putting gallons of gasoline in that big old tank. And that makes it even heavier, <laughs> right? So what I decided to do was I started just to, I put just enough gasoline in the tank to do one yard. That's right. You just, you carry a bunch of cans around with you, you know, at work, in your truck, and you just put just enough in to do that one yard. And you got to time it out just right. You got to measure it out just right because I tell you, I've had a couple of instances well, I was out there and I ran out of gas in the middle of the yard. But luckily, you always have your can in the truck. You can fill it up. But uh, you try to time it where you're pulling up on the trailer and it runs out of gas right when you get <laughs> right when you get on that trailer. Yeah, it runs right out. And then you fill it up for the next yard. Or don't fill it up. Fill it up just enough for the next yard. And what that does is that, uh, that freaking, uh, it's lighter. <laughs> so that just makes a uh, regular knowledge right there that it's lighter it, it, it's not going to take as much gas you know because they ain't got to pull around as much weight <laughs> oh I even tried it and don't tell anybody this oh, this is between me and you this is my new thing I'm doing uh, I've even tried it in the blower and the weed eaters yeah I tried it in them too I mean it don't it don't uh, you know, you don't have, it's not pulling weight on those, but what it does, it helps your back. Cause think about all that. You carrying that heavy gasoline around on your back or in your arms. And uh, if you put this thing up in, hey, 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 <laughs> it's lighter on the old bod. You know what I'm saying? Well, I hope you loved this uh, little uh, demonstration of my brains and uh, i hope you share that out with the world that uh, i'm not only pretty but i'm smart <laughs> so you guys try that i think you'd be amazed at what's going on with that but until i see you guys again i saying 
well, well, but check out uh, King Brandu and old uh, Abram and this and this right here. Let's go over to them and see what they up to. <laughs> Hey, King Brando. Abraham here. And the crop is growing good back here, as you see. Very nice, very that nice. Be yielding some money, some street profit in about a month or so. Well, um, maybe Brand two. Maybe two. So today our agenda is, I got a package in the mail. Uh -huh. and, a big package. Yeah, and it's for the mower over there. Yep, the Lesco. I needed some wheels in the back so I could glide behind it like a pro you we know got, we got something better yeah and uh guys have you ever heard now i know you know velky sulky but have you ever heard the brand name jungle wheels okay if you haven't i just got a brand new box over here we're gonna unbox it yes. uh it is a very uh, old brand <laughs> gonna unbox this thing <laughs> it's a very old brand uh <laughs> You couldn't have brought out box cutters? <laughs> it's a little crazy. These are jungle wheels, baby. Got um, a big knife in the jungle. <laughs> Be careful, you might poke your eye out. Mm -hmm. um, we're going to go over here and unbox this, like I said. Uh, we don't call them jungle wheels. No, we don't call them that. We call them twinks. Yes. They're in between wheels and yeah. uh, right on platform. See, if you have one, they're called twink. Yeah. If you have two, which will be a sulky, I believe, yeah, they're or called, velky. They're called a twinkie twinks. dinks. Twinkie dinks. Yeah. Uh, do you want to go over here and unbox these twinkie dinks, Abraham? Yes, I do. Let's go. <laughs> here we go. We're going. What is up? Show okay. that footage. <laughs> Put your knife ready. <laughs> These so neat. What a colorful box. It is very colorful. There you go. Be careful. We've got to be careful with Abraham's hands. He's smoking, of course. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh, oh, look, the wheel. You got to put them on. That's look something. at this twink. I didn't think about that. You know? The jungle, baby. Hey, be careful in this day and age. All right, here we go. Check it out. Check out that. Jungle gems. Jungle gems. And most importantly, four ply, baby. Four ply. All right, and there you go. Over here. What have we got in here? He gets angry. Oh. Check that out. Oh, cool. Check that out, That's guys. That's pretty neat. <laughs> Instructions. Yeah. Needs that. Looks like you just put the wheels on there and pin them on. Oh, look. Here's the bracket. Must be bracket off. Sweet. So it comes with all this. Here's the pin that goes in. What's this? Oh, nice. Fresh. This is nice. Fresh. Very fresh. Abraham... You've seen the product here. How how nice of a packaging, how nice of a product does it look like they have here? Very nice package. You love it, don't it you? Comes from the jungle and Abraham approves. All right, so to me, it looks like this is a winner. I would go get you some of these if you need some wheels behind a walk behind that doesn't already have a platform to stand on. Yes. Uh, because I'll tell you why I would recommend these. Because if Abraham's excited about it, <laughs> yeah, baby, you best better damn bet that you're <laughs> gonna like it. Because Abraham's got jungle fever. Abraham, out of here.
hey, hit the like button if you don't care. Hey, subscribe to our channel. Okay, that's an important thing to do. If you subscribe to our channel, you'll get all the great content we have. And hit the notification bell that tells you when we're coming out with new things. Hey, look, there's nobody that does lawn care like we do. Nobody that does how-tos like we do. Nobody that does um, reviews like we do. Hey, we're the review daddies. Remember, don't only survive on YouTube, thrive on YouTube with the Lawn Stars. We'll see you next time. Big Mo. Big Mo. Shut it off now. I'm done. This road is hot. It's hot out here. Come on now. Big Mo, please. I can hear the cicadas. Braves are doing pretty good. This has been a Lone Stars Dramedy Network presentation dolling.